have been enjoying my weekly vlogs and enjoying the Sheen haul. Uh, if you've seen it, obviously, you may be new here. If you are new here, please go and like and subscribe and leave comments and all that jazz. Um, today I am going to be doing another haul. I am going to be doing a Primark haul. <laughs> Uh, so I actually went into Primark to get a few show bits because um, I'm sure you know by now um, Gatepost are doing Bad Girls um, at Formark Hall in March so I was trying to get a few show bits <laughs> um, it didn't end up being show bits at all well it did one thing <laughs> Um, so, okay, I'll start off with the show bit, because that's probably a good place to start. So the thing that I needed was a men's shirt, um, that's, like, oversized, um, and so I got this. Um, it was a right bog, and it was £5. I thought it was going to be, like... 13 pounds or something like that um because i don't know why i just i just thought it would be um so yeah um it needs to be long sleeved because um basically we're being prison guards um for one song but it's it's a bit of a piss take really um that's why we're having men's shirts and not women's shirts i suppose um, oh my god, there is so much packaging on this. Oh my... Why do they need so much packaging for a shirt? This is insane. Like, I just ripped a load off the back. And there's still more in it. I'm, I'm going to leave that in, actually. Just in case. Um, so, yeah. This is the shirt. This looks quite oversized, which is good. Um... It's got the long sleeves, which is good because I bought, well, Don bought me one before. Um, and it turned out to be short sleeved, which is highly frustrating. But he didn't realise, and I didn't realise until I got it to rehearsal. And uh, the woman who is sorting out costumes went, uh, This is short sleeves, need long sleeves. And I was just a bit like, Okay. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so. I've got this in size 16.5. I think that's literally just this. But I'm not entirely sure. I have no idea. I have no idea how men's clothes work. I just seem to buy them a lot, as you'll see in this video. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is what I'll be wearing. Please, please, please get your tickets for Bad Girls. Um, message me for tickets, and I'll sort you some out if you pay me. <laughs> Um, so yeah, or just go on the website. Thanks a lot for that. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a great show. So anyway, that's the show plug done. <laughs> um, so on to the work stuff now. Um, so I had a bit of a clear out quite a while ago, slash still going on. And one of the things that I try to do is get rid of a lot of the black stuff. So like black socks is something I got rid of and some of them I give to Dom <laughs> uh, and now I've started my new job at the cinema uh, they've turned around and said you need black socks to cover your ankles because you can't show your ankles why well, I don't know but I'm going with it um, so I've had to buy some black socks um, I didn't want to go plain black because that's just not me so I bought like they're coloured pastel coloured soles so it's pastel colours and these were £2.50 and they feel so soft and I am so ready to wear these, I'm not even going to lie. Also for work I have bought two pairs of skinny jeans because that is part of the uniform. Um, I've bought them in two different sizes. These are the 32 inch leg because uh, I have no idea what size leg I am and apparently all of the stuff that I buy has been too short because I obviously just pick them off the top and I think that's like 28 leg and I'm definitely not 28 leg I am I'm quite I don't know I, I feel like I'm quite long legged long a lot yes long legged so 
I've gone for the 32 inch. I put it up against me, so let's see what happens. But yeah, these are the <laughs> 32 inch jeans. They are quite like, what's the word? Like hard, but not hard. I don't know what the word is. They feel sturdy. There you go, sturdy. Um, and these have, were seven pounds, which I thought was an absolute. Uh, <laughs> absolute bargain in itself and then I realized the tag actually has a sale on it and it was down to five pounds which made me so so happy <laughs> um so yeah I bought them in the 32 inch and then I've bought the exact same ones but I've also bought them in the 34 inch because who knows what size I am <laughs> um again seven pounds down to five pounds uh, also these are the mid-rise ones as well um so yeah i'll be wearing them for work later um i say later in about <laughs> need to hurry up. um <laughs> in not very long apparently um <laughs> also another thing that i seem to uh struggle with is leggings um again i wash them and they obviously shrink so I have to buy new ones and I like the cosy ones even though they don't seem to be that cosy anymore which is kind of sad because the ones I bought before were like really fleecy insides um but these don't really feel that fleecy they don't really feel that thick either which is kind of annoying even though it says on them that they are improved quality so We'll see about that. <laughs> um, I've got these in the XL length just because all of my other ones have been short and I figured they're gonna shrink in the wash. So there you go. I've got these in size small. Um, and these were five pounds, which I think is a bit annoying as they're not actually that thick. But hey, there we go. So the next thing I bought, um, basically my slippers at the minute are falling apart for one um and also they make my feet absolutely stink <laughs> um <laughs> so yeah um i decided to buy some cheap cheerful little i don't they're called slipper socks but they're definitely not slipper socks that's not what i would call slipper socks um but these were actually two pounds which i thought was a right bargain um they're hella cute um they're just grey and a bit marbly I guess and um, they've got this little bow and I thought they'd be just really cute for like slipping on in my PJs and hopefully they won't make and they're also they're like towelly like feel I don't know how to describe it but it's soft <laughs> very soft but they're not fleece so theoretically they shouldn't make my feet stink but here we go we'll try it so yeah yeah. The next thing I bought was <laughs> I bought a new fleecy inside jumper um, because my fleecy inside jumper is pink and it's exactly the same one as Dom's but pink instead of grey uh, but it doesn't very fit me anymore. <laughs> Basically I've gained weight and muscle and got bigger and none of my face clothes fit anymore so I'm having to sell loads of them so if you want them go and check out my depop or facebook marketplace and you'll find them there um <laughs> so yeah um so I decided to buy a new one um this was quite expensive and the next one is quite expensive as well but I feel like I am gonna wear these quite a lot because of what they are um so this is a hoodie this is a hoodie. I'm gonna have to move back to this thing. Da, da, da. And, then, uh, and it has <laughs> it has like a knitted underneath, like on the sleeve. It's like knitted one side and then just the the normal jersey fabric on the top. Um, but the inside is literally all fleece which i am very excited about because it looks so cozy uh this is in th these next things including this is from the men's section 
um, because apparently women aren't allowed fleece jumpers anymore, you know. Um, apparently women aren't allowed anything that's cool anymore, so, you know, <laughs> I just went for the, the, uh, better option of the men's, so, there you go. Um, but yeah, this is fleeced all inside. I am so excited to wear this, it's real. Um, what would make this perfect is actually having zipped pockets. I just had to check that, I genuinely thought it did and it didn't. Oh, that's sad. Um, anyway. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is quite expensive, but it was £12. Um, it was down from 16 so it's quite a good sale, I guess. Um, but yeah, I feel like I'm going to wear this a ton. And the last two things. The last two things are like the same because they're a tracksuit basically. Um, so again, had to get rid of a pair of joggers that I thought fit me and they didn't. I bought some new ones. Um, so these are like in a, a navy marbly... I don't know what this pattern is called, it's speckled I guess, um, but they are cinched in at the waist with drawstrings and they, they are cinched in at the ankles as well. Um, they also have this really nice detailing on, they have like just lines, I just find that really, really nice, it's just really it's just a bit different, you know? It's just, just nice. <laughs> um, these were £10 on their own. These are an SA small. They have... <laughs> I just realised it's got one pocket at the back, but not on the, like, literally just one side. How strange. Um, but the thing that drew me to them is the fact that they have zippy pockets. <laughs> game changer. Absolute game changer. I mean... The pocket's not that big, but, oh, maybe, maybe they're just deep. So, yeah, so, okay, okay, that's, that's game changing. I like that. I can fit my hand inside, so that's good. <laughs> that's what we need in the dogger bottoms. Um, but yeah, that was the thing that drew me to them, because I was like, I've never seen that before. Um, and I'm really obsessed with these pockets so bad <laughs> uh, um and also these are fleece lined so i was just a bit like yes please because my other joggy bottoms they're the friends ones which are really really comfy um but they don't have pockets which is really annoying but girls aren't allowed pockets apparently I literally look everywhere in Primark, in, in the girls section, for fleece hoodies and fleece joggers with pockets. And it's either a normal hoodie that's got no texture inside, or it's a hoodie that's a coat, or like really, really fleecy and it's like sheepskin, basically, so it's really expensive. Um, or the jogger bottoms just didn't have pockets, or they weren't fleece lined, or they were just like really weirdly skinny and may as well be leggings, and it was just really weird. So, yeah, men's is probably the way to go. Um, so to go with the joggy bottoms, I got the matching hoodie. <laughs> um, yeah, it's the same print, it's got the lines down the sides, as you can imagine. Um, this is actually more expensive than the joggy bottoms, which kind of is a bit shook. I'm a bit shook. That's what I was trying to say. Again, fleece lined, which I am excited about. Um, this was £12. It's got a little Lego here. There you go. A little Lego there. Um, and it's the same pattern. Um, these pockets are just normal pockets, as you can imagine in a hoodie. Um, yeah, and this is also in a plus more. So, yeah. So, that is it for Primark haul. For my Primark haul. <laughs> ah, yes, 
okay um yeah so that's all i've got to show you today i hope you enjoyed this i hope you're enjoying the weekly vlogs and the hauls and the different videos that i hopefully will try and think of <laughs> um yeah uh go like and subscribe comment with more video ideas and everything that you like tell me whether you like it or not give me some insight into life that'd be great and most importantly please do not forget to get tickets for bad girls please please come and support me <laughs> um so yes <laughs> yeah so all that jazz and i shall see you next time probably in my weekly vlog so i hope you enjoy it and i'll see you then bye